organizing this event on the International Clinical Engineering and Health Technology Management Congress. We're uh, very happy to be here. I am Adriana Velázquez, uh, Senior Advisor for Medical Devices in WHO. And we consider the importance of clinical engineers in the healthcare system because clinical engineers can help set what is the kind of medical devices that are required in, clinical, in, in the clinical setting uh, that would respond to the needs of the diseases of the population. And then to manage really the correct devices to reach the hospital and then to be used appropriately so that they can improve the healthcare of the patients to make sure that whatever they have, like if, for example, in laboratory, in surgery, in imaging, that it will be the best equipment, that it works well, that it provides the output that the doctors want, and that the patients have really their, their results as soon as possible and in a safe way, and they are treated uh, best. So in reality, the role of the clinical engineers is very important in hospitals, but it is also important in the government to make decisions also of what technology should be in which type of hospitals. It is also very important to define uh, for primary health care for people that are like outside the big hospitals, but just the general population, that they can maintain their health, uh, for example, to measure blood pressure, to measure the glucose monitoring, cardiac health, so that we remain healthy. You know? So the importance of the clinical engineering is trying to find those technologies that need to be there in primary healthcare, but also at home. So which technologies can you have at home that can help you monitor your chronic diseases, for example? You know? So there's a wide spectrum. It is helping the industry, helping the governments, helping the, the but mainly it's helping healthcare workers and their patients.